Three Averett Express employees are considered heroes after rendering aid to a fellow employee who had a heart attack on the job. Uh, that story began here at the Averett Express facility on Chapman Road back in February when employee Paul Palacio uh, went into cardiac arrest. Now, Hamilton County EMS officials say the quick intervention by three of his fellow employees is part of the reason that he's still here today. Yeah, we were uh, breaking a trailer down on, on the dock on 47 door and, uh, and Paul was doing, had the manifest and, and he was going about his normal job and we just started. And I turned around and looked and Paul was on his back. So it was a normal day in the office um, and one of the dock associates came to me in my office and uh, notified me that there was a vent. Reggie McMahon had already had 911 dispatch on on the phone, so he was quick to respond on that end. Um, Bob Voss, other dock worker, was also um, checking for a pulse at the time, um, and, and there wasn't one to be found. I obtained the AED, um, administered it, um, and we just continued that process until the uh, EMTs and fire department uh, arrived on scene. And we knew sure he was gone. We didn't think there was any way possible. Today, a ceremony honoring the heroes who wear red. <laughs> Avery Express employees who went beyond their job descriptions to save a friend and fellow employee's life. I was told I shouldn't be here. The doctors, they, they actually thought I was going to be uh, brain dead at one time. A week or two later, he came up on the dock, come out there to thank us. And that was worth everything in the world, just, just to talk with him again. You know, it was very scary uh, to see somebody there lifeless, um, laying on the platform, uh, other dock associates involved. Um, but um, luckily, um, as always, uh, our people step up to the, to the plate. This is a very positive out outcome. This is what we want. Uh, more of. This slogan here on our wall that says our driving force is people is something that I uh, bring up to every associate whether it be an interview process or someone that comes into our building because that's not something that that I take lightly that's not something that we've developed overnight but in our 50 years of, of uh, being in existence as a company that's something that has been carried on for, for each individual year and um, and this recognition ceremony today was just another example of that, of recognizing our people um, for what we do every day, maybe not be into a life-saving measure, but whether it be on the dock, whether it be in a tractor delivering to our customer, um, what we do every day is about people. But I'm still here thankful and thankful for all the people that brought me through that.